Hey guys, this is Gadget Check here and today we are going to be taking a look at the first UA ROM for the Samsung Galaxy Ace. So the ROM comes in two packages, the one is a CWM4 file and the other one is the ROM itself, first UA ROM. These two files will be found in the XTA post, I'll link that post to the video's description so that you guys can go and download it there. As shown here, you have to put it on your desktop. Once that's done, copy these two files to your SD card on your Samsung Galaxy Ace. And remember, the A should be running on Android 2.3.4 uh, KPH firmware for this to work exactly. As you can see here, my Ace is running on 2.3.4 KPH uh, and the build is CodeROM V1B. I have another video showing how to install CodeROM V1B, so you be sure to check that out if you are not already on uh, CodeROM V1B. Once that's done, open up my files, see the C put the CWM4 file on that, and then reboot uh, your phone into the, the recovery. Uh, once your phone has rebooted into the recovery, you can get a screen like this. Go into apply updates from SD card, the second one. Uh, use the volume rocker. Then use the home button uh, to get into the menu. Uh, and select the CWM4 file and hit the menu button. Uh, it takes uh, around roughly 15 seconds. Once that's done, reboot the phone again. Uh, it takes some time for it to reboot. I'll be editing this video so it might seem fast for you guys. <laughs> uh, once you are into the uh, home screen itself, reboot the phone again, get into the recovery and you'll find that you're in a new recovery which is the CWM4 recovery uh, which has more options than the earlier one. Uh, use, only using this uh, recovery you can you flash the first UA ROM. Now the second file, the first UA ROM, the ROM file itself, put that in your uh, phone's SD card. Uh, and uh, uh, once that's done, uh, go back again into the recovery. So I have rebooted the phone right now. Uh, once the phone has rebooted, uh, go into the application, My Files. Uh, as you can see, I have the first UA ROM there. Now reboot the phone, hold the power button, go into the recovery. Uh, inside the recovery, uh, I'll show you what you have to do. Uh, now you are in the CWM recovery. Uh, use the third option in the CWM. That's in third uh, option and not the third option, I guess. Uh, use the install from zip and install this zip uh, from the SD card. That's the first UA ROM zip from the SD card. If you have, if you guys have any doubt, just ask me below in this video's description. I'll be glad to help you guys out. Flash the first UA ROM as you can see right now, and hit yes. And once that's done your ROM will be flashed. Uh, this takes roughly around uh, one minute or so for it to flash the whole ROM. And by the way, this ROM is the best that I've encountered yet on the Galaxy Ace. There are better ROMs there, but nothing uh, compared to this stands out. This has all the hacks, everything in it. Uh, it's a mixture of both worlds. It's, it's completely fluid. I've tested the ROM and it's superb. Uh, till now, it's the best. I don't know about the future, but now it's the best future updates for this ROM will be coming. Uh, and I've just found a couple of bugs, not much. Little small bugs, but that's not a big deal. Uh, every ROM has its own bugs. And this is possibly the only ROM which has the least bugs and it's, it's good for daily use. It's the best for daily use. So uh, let's wait for the phone to reboot. Yep, it's done. Uh, so let's reboot the phone now and get into the home screen itself or into the OS itself uh, once uh, your phone has been rebooted right now I'm powering it off and now there the phone is it has a cyanogen mod uh, live wallpaper I love I love this wallpaper uh, and the first boot takes around five minutes I've edited this video so uh, bear with me guys uh, and as you can see once you're booting into the ROM uh, the language is different so don't panic you can change the language, just do as I do in this video. So this is possibly what you will get once you've on your first boot. Uh, once the first boot is done, uh, just hit the back, go into the settings tab, like I'm showing you right here. And exactly above, right there, the, click the button that I just clicked and then hit English, uh, United States, there, done. Uh, now you're back on the English language. Uh, Location and text is a tab which you should click, the one I clicked earlier. 
I couldn't read it in the other language. So right now it's, it clicked me that I clicked location and settings. So location and text, sorry. Once that's done, as you can see, this is the home screen. It's using Go Launcher, which is one of the best launchers available right now. And I love the ROM. It's just beautiful, fluid. Uh, it's it, there's no lag in the system. It's very fast. It has um, many. It has another app called Tweaks, which I'll show in a couple of minutes from now. Uh, so this is how the entire UI looks. Pretty smooth, no lag in the system. Um, excellently built. Very few bugs and. Uh, not many bugs, only developers can find that out, the bugs. But then normal users will never find these bugs out. So pretty interesting. I'll show the about phones to you guys. And as you can see, the Android version is 2.3.4 kph and first year ROM v1.0. So now the tweaks part I was talking about, go into the application drawer. There is an app called Tweaks, open it up, allow super user permission. Uh, the, so these are the tweaks that are available in this ROM. None of the other ROMs has this. This is the only ROM that has it. So apply all the ones that I'm applying right now. RAM mini free, speed tweak, no, uh, no time IO tweak, IO scheduler, IO deadline scheduler, kernel scheduler. Don't hit the CPU conservation. So that is kind of buggy right now. Uh, the swipiness, uh, hit that. Dirtiness, yes, you need that too. Uh, as you can see, I'm hitting all these. Uh, you don't know the media. Um, let's see. Nah, no, 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 not the media one. Use the auto start one that allows uh, apps to SD. Uh, and then hit apply changes and bam, you reboot. So thanks guys for watching this video. If you enjoy this video, please subscribe to my channel.